Oh. All right. All right. So starting it. right off, Ostrich goes Darth Shard. One. Go. We're right in the top eight. So winners round one is technically Ooh. winners quarters. Wow. What a time to be alive. What a time to be alive. All right. So uh, Darth Shard, this is a farewell to him. We hope for good things from him. Do I need to move the mic closer again? Oh, you're good. I'm just always worried I'm gonna like it's gonna catch my mouth, man. No, I think you're good. No, there's not enough uh, an an antiseptic in the world. Not enough antiseptic. Whatever. In the world. What? Uh, what's the the hand gel stuff? You know what I'm talking about? Antibacterial. Antibacterial. Yeah, I got you. Go. I got you. Yeah, we're so a really early, a really early stock there for uh, for dive shard Kirby things. I mean. Yeah, it's sort of a universal that in a game like Kirby this. Kirby is just accepted as broken after Triple R won the Arcadian <laughs> yesterday, despite the fact that I've only heard him say like negative things and like, oh Kirby, yes. they broke him, they made him awful. Even yeah, though he's like a god. And uh, yeah, so he took the Arcadian, um, took that cool, probably made like hundred, couple hundred bucks. It's not bad. Yeah, he did. That he did. Oh, home run! Touch them all, Kirby Bucket. Let's go. Uh, <laughs> so. I mean, who's the favorite? But I mean, Dark Shard's definitely been putting in the work. He's wanted to make his time here in Minnesota count before he oh, moves absolutely. out west. And it's ho hopefully, he can show something here. Oh, let's go with the trades! Wow, that was good. I mean, all things considered. Yo, this game, I, some hype. There's some hype. Dark Shard brings the hype. He brings the assignment. He brings the electricity. Oh dear. So, uh, yeah, this is a. Uh, this is a battle. Oh, oh wow! This is a battle for uh, the best glasses wearing PM player. I, this is of the, the day. battle for the best who can SD the most stylishly. I guess <laughs> this is fine. Hey, That's it's fine. Not, you're not flying. You're falling with style. Uh, so uh, no. let's go, Buzz. Um, oh jeez. That side D. I don't think he's dumb. Oh, fair, fair train. No. Oh, comes back with a couple snares. And he's just, you know space him out, keep him on the platform. Oh, bear. No conversion, close back. Smash four boys. Oh, um Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh the hammer. What I like is I mean the hammer sort of just sort of there and she sort of persuade you not to approach. I mean especially Ness who at this point will want to kill primarily with throws or with easy conversions. The hammer sort of says, Wow Oh no Okay, that's fine. This is fine. Hey we take those. Absolutely. Right to the bank. Always left and right, left, right and center. Always. Darth Shard has no bands. No, he probably has bands. Yeah, yeah, he probably has bands. He probably has. I've always thought about doing that, and then I'm like, wait, I really don't want to play on Dreamland. Never mind. One, go. Oh, yo, 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 time him out. Yo, time him out. You have the damage. Go, just run. There's, there's gotta be an infinite stall. Oh no, wait. This how oh, you can't do that. You, yeah. you get less time. That's oh, that's like that's a good change. I'm I'm, I'm a fan of that. Explain it. Uh, so the more times that you grab the stage, the window to get your refresh invincibility is tighter and tighter. Oh right, yeah, yeah. So you can't just you know be Me Too King and just like right ledge stall. Ledge stall for like four minutes until they get impatient and then sh you know throw them off and give them. I mean you still can do that, but then you can be punished for it more easily. Sure. So that's a you know. Oh the stall. I really like I really like the uh, the. I don't know what it's called in this game, but the uh, when it, the, the energy absorber when they use it when he uses it as a stall. Oh, PK magnet. Do, PK magnet. Yeah. I've seen him do that off stage when I've seen yeah. him play before. I've seen him do it. Kind of, he's kind of he basically uses it exactly like a shine. It's a little worse, obviously. Yeah. But you know, Fox privilege. But it's still pretty cool. But it's one of those things where if you're playing a character like Ness, who the yeah. opponent sort of thinks they know how you're going to recover because they think oh you only one way to recover. Yeah. Any little stall helps. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I definitely think that it goes to show mastery of your character and just getting every little bit out of your tools Ooh, again. Wow. Uh, I sort of think he wanted to SDI down, or DI is, down and tech the stage. Yo, is, what is Sam doing? It's getting close. It's getting close. You're right. Upset alert. Upset alert. E ESPN. Let's see it. Let's get that red banner. Oh. Upset alert. This would be. This would be a pretty big upset. This would probably be the best win Dark Shards had here. Oh, the hammer. DDD? Or as Sync would say, day to day? Did you, really? Oh, I know. No. Sorry about it. <laughs> <laughs> that is not the correct pronunciation of that. Dooter! And let's see if he can go here. See that? A little like, oh, oh no, but he missed the angle. So what we learned there was the best edge guard is no edge guard. Smash um, 4? <laughs> yeah, it seems like it sometimes. Haha! <laughs> <laughs> uh, right. Oh, that's right. This isn't Twitch. There's no haha. Never mind. No haha. And. Oh, interesting. Oh no. Okay, he's fine. 
Up tilt, 64 boys, backer. Oh, but he gets out of there with a nice snare. Oh, good fair to get back on stage and get stage position. And that led to the back air stage conversion. Really smart, really heads up there by Dark Shark. Oh, edge. Oh, he saw him. He saw him trying to do those dash back grabs, and so he baited it out and then hit him with the nair. That was really smart right there. Good adaptation from Blue. He he, he really has gotten stronger as it's gone on. Well, it's hard not to be stronger than two SDs and a lot of huge flubs. Yeah. Hey man. So just gave away the. We're not supposed to make the storyline. We're supposed to let them develop. Oh, I don't, see. Don't I'm sorry. Be like I'm that. sorry. I'm sorry. Don't be like that. Ah, uh, I apologize. <laughs> oh, up till oh, nice trade. What the? Oh, okay. Ooh, good platform follow-up, but good DI to get out of there. Maybe could have gotten more. PK fired a back air, not gonna kill. I don't. Uh, it's like 0 for 6 on those. I don't know. Maybe it's more of a cutting off his option tools, but it seems pretty committal and slow to just be cutting off a single option kind of tool. A lot of shield grabs. I wonder if he's getting nervous. Also, Jaku has really stepped up the movement. He's really stepped up, kind of just throwing hit bo hitboxes right outside of his shield grab range, and that's kind of been a problem for Dark Shard. He's been caught trying to shield grab, trying to just dash back grab. So we'll have to see if he makes that adjustment. Because honestly, I think game one he was moving better. I don't know, the punishes were mm. different and maybe better in game two, but his movement in game one, you know, you can, no reason to lose confidence now. I mean, you're in there. Yeah, absolutely. Whether you, you, have that, you have that game one to rest on. Like, whether you think that, you know, it was how it should have been or not, you're in there. One. So you gotta take it. You gotta take all their money. You gotta take their cookies. Gotta take their cookies. You gotta turn that horse into glue. Dang. Got him. Good fire. Good turn going. horses into glue, though. Alright, see more movement. Uh, green Green seems like a good counter pick. It seems like... Oh, please get the recovery. All right, good job. It seemed like uh, a big difference in game two was uh, Austin who definitely made better use of space and definitely made better use of uh, platform tricks. And so maybe just taking away the space, taking away those set platforms for him to get those little uh, movement tricks off of will be a good counter pick. Seems seems to be working out so far. Uh, more fair. Austin who kind of backed off. Back here is not going to kill. Good DI. Oh, there. No follow-up. Jumps out of there. Avoids the down smash. Ooh. Fair to no one. Fair to no one. What? Oh. Fair to no one. Oh. I just got it. It took me a little while. Ooh. Oh, he wanted it. That would have actually been a really good follow-up, but it just came in there for side B. Oh, but takes the stock here. Austin, he's looking heated. Ooh, dash tech. That should be it. Oh, huh. First hitbox of the fair doesn't kill. Should get the edge card, though. Ride the wall. Wow, yeah, there you go. Nice. I wonder if it's possible to get an angle where you speed spot that. Oh, probably if you went a little lower. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like that'd be really tough, especially right. if you... Yeah. It's not Firefox. You're, like, hitting yourself with this thing. This is the sort of down throw. No fair follow. Good DI and jumped out. Oh, the side me. Oh, there. Can you get it? No, nothing. No follow-up. Also, the music is dank. I don't know. Shout out to the PM dev team. Nair puts an edge guard situation in the back air. Cuts off PK fire, but he has it again. See if he can get this here. Good aerial drift there. That was really smart. Those Captain Falcon tricks. <laughs> Oh, back here. Although maybe Falcon doesn't have to do that in DM. I don't know, man. Maybe his recovery is actually good for once. You know, he deserves it. PK Magnet, no follow up. Kind of jumped out of there with the dare, gets safe position, but then he goes right back to the corner. Uh, I really think that, you know, Glue has definitely had a lot more stage control in games 2 and 3. Game 1, game one seems really even, but game 2 and 3, it's really been off just Glue in the center, harassing Darth Shard, and then Darth Shard trying to make counterplay or trying not, just not to have bad things happen to him in the form of like shield grabs and dash back grabs and some uh you know fares out of the corner but it seems like blue is taking advantage to get that spike though let's go dang you don't try to do these fancy things on me buddy i got i got a foot stick that foot out <laughs> tippy toes you kick him in the eye right as he come right just come up just kick him right in his ugly head. head dang well it's plenty of it yeah there's a lot of <laughs> there's a lot of head there dang, dang. that's that hey that was a solid set the though scary for sure Ooh, we got some crazy blue effects going on there on the camera. Ooh, that's kind of nice.
Yep. Uh, da -ba -dee -da -ba -da. Da -ba -dee da 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 da